close your eyes, and try to stay with the breath. When the breath is coming in, stay with the sensation of the breath all the way in, and then with the sensation of the breath all the way out. And then each time the breath comes in again, just stick with that breath too. Just stay with the sensation of breathing as consistently as you can. Of course, you're going to find that other thoughts are going to come into the mind, but you don't have to follow them. You don't have to get involved with them. Just stay with the sensation of breathing and see what kind of sense of comfort you can create out of the breath. This is an important part of the meditation, is getting a sense of ease and well-being right here. Because it alerts you to the fact that there's an awful lot of happiness, an awful lot of pain that comes from within. In other words, we think that happiness and pleasure and pain and sorrow are things that we get from outside things that other people do or things that happen to us. We're not really paying attention to the fact that we're creating a lot of suffering and stress on our own, which is ironic because everything we do is for the sake of pleasure, for the sake of well-being. And yet we turn around and create a lot of stress and suffering. It's like we set up a factory, hoping to create happiness with a factory, and then the inspectors in the factory aren't paying careful attention. And after all, the factory starts producing pain. Why is that? Because the inspectors are looking outside. They're not looking at the results of the, what the factory is doing. And that's the same with the mind. The mind very rarely checks the results of its own actions. And if the pain comes up, you blame somebody else, either somebody close to your family or somebody off in Washington or New York or wherever in the world. But the problem is the suffering we have is coming from right here. But our inspectors are out inspecting everybody else. Is this person good? Is that person good? And usually other people don't live up to your expectations, and so of course you can blame them for your happiness and unhappiness. But they're not really the real causes. The real causes come from within. So you've got to bring your inspectors back inside. Look at what you're doing. Be very observant. What are you doing? What are you saying? What are your intentions? All too often we do things and say things, and if someone asks us what our intentions were, we have to make up something on the spot. You know, probably meant this or probably meant that. That's because we weren't there. The inspectors were off inspecting things outside. So bring the inspectors back inside. This is one of the reasons why we meditate. So you can catch the movements of the mind as they happen. And that we can see, oh, this is a skillful intention, this is an unskillful intention. Skillful intentions should be encouraged, unskillful ones should not. You keep watch on your mind like this, and you'll find that your factory starts producing the kind of happiness you want. So make, your inspect make sure your inspectors are looking at the right place, what you're doing and saying and thinking, right here, right now. And this is why we focus attention on the breath, because when you're with the breath, you're right here, right now. Anything that comes out of the mind is going to come out right here, so you get to see it. This way your inspectors are on the job, and the factory that you've got inside is going to create all the happiness that you want. It's not going to start creating sloppy merchandise as it has been in the past. So make sure you stay right here as you go through the day. Your breath is always right here. You can always stay centered right here. Even when you have to think about other things, think about them and then come right back. Make this your home place. Make this the place where inspectors are well established. Otherwise you go inspecting other people, other things outside. And the place where you really should be responsible gets neglected, and you go out trying to be responsible for other people's activities, and that gets everybody all messed up. So stay right here so you can be responsible for what your factory is creating. Make sure the merchandise is all good. You'll benefit, and the people around you will benefit as well. <laughs>